Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. We are here in Dusseldorf, Germany at the world's largest RV show taking a look at an awesome motorhome that sits on the Volkswagen chassis. This is the Knaus Van Station. We are going to be taking a look at this unit and maybe some other Volkswagen motorhomes. We're super excited to show everybody. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. Today I am super excited. Andrea, we've been looking all show. We have. We finally found finally. Motorhome, a German motorhome made on the German chassis, the Volkswagen. But before I begin, let's say hi to Andrea. Hey Andrea! Hey everyone! How's it going today? It's going really good, you guys. I'm super excited. You know I love Volkswagen. I've always had Volkswagens when I was growing up. Yes. So yeah, I want to see this. Fun fact, Andrea's relative stepfather no my grandmother your grandmother had a no who who had the volkswagen dealership oh uh my uh grandparents and my uncle very good in, in pasadena they own nice. the volkswagen volvo dealership nice yes. which is pretty fine so andrea we're over here hello uh, you are maxine 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 nice to meet you thank, thank you. you so much for helping oh, us you're today very welcome. Good to tell have us you. a little bit about you and Knaus. I'm so, I'm so bad. Knaus. Yeah. Knaus. So, uh, for everybody that's international, the brand is pronounced Knaus in German. Yes. And this is our newest van station model. So this is on the Volkswagen T6.1 basis. So okay. the chassis is a, a lovely German car, so to say. And the special thing about this vehicle is that it's extremely compact, um, but it has a lot of features. So at the moment, a trend, especially in Germany, in the RV industry, is that everything's kind of slimming down a bit. Okay. So vehicles are becoming flexible and compact, um, but you want to have as much features as possible, of course. Yes, um, let's start up front with the chassis. Yeah. I love seeing this. This is just, I, I really would have thought I would have seen more on this. Yeah, right. Why is other brands not doing this so much? Um, so right now, what's happening in the industry, especially let's say with Fiat, um, is that there's supply chain issues. Yes. So I've spoken to people on the fair, they bought a vehicle or an RV about one year, one and a half years ago, and they're still waiting on their delivery. Wow. So what's been happening is that we're looking for alternatives. And of course, being in Germany, what better option is there than Volkswagen? Yes. Right? <laughs> Say um, it again. Volkswagen. Yes. Yeah. Like, <laughs> um, so basically, they can actually deliver and they have their own production stall and production facilities within Germany which right now with everything that's going on is obviously a huge advantage. Yes. Um, yes. So it's just kind of the reliability and being actually able to sell vehicles that customers don't have to wait one to two years for. Yes. Diesel? Yeah. Uh, what size is the engine? So it's a 150 horsepower two liter diesel engine. Okay. Nice bunk over, not, uh, nice cab over with the awesome windshield. What else do we have going on the outside? Um, well, for, I'm so sorry. First, look at these tires, Andrea. They're the Bridgestones. I love those. These are the 215-60R17. Sorry about that. Oh, no worries, no worries. So exactly, um, just a little bit about the vehicle. It's five meters 89 in length. Okay. And the width is two meters 15 on the outside, two yes. meters on the inside. And you have a height of about two meters and 90. Wow, very nice. I'm, I'm loving these windows. Everybody's doing the Thule awning. Absolutely. This is 85? Exactly, so this is the Vansation Special Edition. Yes. Uh, which starts at almost 80,000. Wow. And then we have the weight, the maximum carry weight stocked up to three and a half tons. Okay. Uh, which explains the higher price as well. Yes. Um, so the basis model, if you're looking at the most simplest version of the MQ500, uh, you'd be looking at a starting price of around 67,000. Wow, wow. Storage. Right here we have a little bit of storage. And then... Is that for bikes? Exactly. Up on so the other if side. You go around the other side. You can take a look at the garage. Oh look at that. Watch your step, Andrea. See, I like this. I like how small it is and nimble. Yes. And these are all fan stations. Exactly. So these four here are the exact same models. Oh wow! Good. It's just Good. Uh, you've got a, a less busy day today, so usually yes. Big queues. You know. Yes. Wow. So it's so popular, they need four of them. I have to imagine this is one of the top sellers. Yeah. Yes. Let's, I'm not a seller myself, but uh, well, kind of, I'm a middleman, so yes. if someone's interested, I, I hand them over. Um, but you're, yeah. you're a factory rep. Exactly. We have them over in America. Thank you. Yeah, that's why we didn't do the other brand, because yeah. it was all salespeople. Uh, and being a salesperson, I don't like taking salespeople yeah. off the floor. Yeah. 
it might be lost. It's yes, it's just a yeah. little bit of storage. Yeah. Very cool. Oh, Andrea. <laughs> Let's see what Look it's like. Look at this. This is so neat. I mean, this. you know what this reminds me of? A Winnebago Rialta. You know, obviously oh, yeah. a little bit more modern. But the Rialta was on the Volkswagen chassis. It was. Chassis. It was on the Volkswagen chassis. Yeah. So we had Volkswagen in America from 95 to 2002 yeah. or 4. Yeah. Um, but it was only Winnebago doing it. Very nice insides. Yeah. So we have an automatic gearbox as well now. Okay. Yeah. Very good. And um, this brand has other things. So let's take a look at the inside of this. Absolutely. Thank you. What does that mean? Um, this is, all right, so the, oh. the Bulli, um, that's a bit of German culture, German history. So Volkswagen had the Bulli, which was the original chassis of this. Okay. Um, and it's kind of this, the kind of hippie bus that you see, oh, you know, yeah, the, the VW, yeah, yeah. long, uh, small and short. Um, and people used to build these out themselves and then Volkswagen kind of got on the trend. Um, and there's still models being built that are named California, for example. Yes. Oh. And um, it's kind of a cult. That's why you advertise it with the name Bully, because people who like uh, who like their Bully recognize that this is built on the same shot. Nice. nice. I love that. It's like the Scooby-Doo. No, not the Scooby-Doo. We had an orange one in our dealership, remember? Yes. All right. Take a look at the inside. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Wow. It is a bunk over the couch. It is. Wow. Oh my goodness, I did not expect that. And then I'm just going to show here, very different. So are people driving these as their daily Little drivers as well? Storage um, above. Very hard to tell. Completely, okay. completely depends on the person, obviously. Um, but the simple advantage you have is that it's so compact, it's right? Belted. Yes. So six meters in length also means you can get on ferries a lot easier. <gasps> okay. Two meters ninety in height means that at toll stations you pay a low fee. Um, oh, so it's really meant for true. people that like to travel around a lot. Yes. Um, and also for people that like to take a weekend trip. Oh yes. yes. The optimal weekend trip. Um, this version now, as you can tell, four beds. Holy um, smokes! Yeah. I yeah. it just kept going. Yeah. I, I I like cut cut you off out of the image because I didn't realize this is amazing. Yeah. Wow! And then this flips back up. Exactly. And then and they have a it slides. Net there. Or... Slides, and you can tell how easy it is to slide. Oh wow. wow! And it had a safety net as well. Exactly. Very cool. Exactly. And then oh, you wow. just have to um, take oh, it right back that in. That is so take cool. It right back in. Yeah. And then this seat swivels. This this one? Yes, absolutely. Wow. I'm loving so the they tables over around. here. Yeah. Yes, the tables also, are so nice. Of course, Seats. easily expandable. Wow. So then you can have a so, nice, comfortable yes. meal, place wow. cards with four people. TV. Oh. Nice looking Very windows. Very interesting <laughs> curtains. Andrea, how do you like them? I think they're cute. Oh. Approved. Bing. Oh, very nice. Got the sunroof with the lights. The lights are really cute over here, and I'm loving, I'm loving the cabinetry. I really am. Do you want to take that? Yes. Um, look at that. Nice storage. And then it, that is soft closed. Absolutely. Yeah. Yes. Everything is over here. I'm noticing two burner gas cooktop, and there's the sink. Yes. Nice okay. little fridge right there. Okay. And then we've got some drawers here. I bet you they are soft closed as well. Oh. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. Very nice. And then there is a little closet to your right, Andrea. Oh yay! So this is um this is the real oh, selling point. Oh my god! Of the Holy smokes! Oh wow! Get, get that door all the way open. I have not seen a bathroom like this. Not in a unit in this a, small. In a unit this small ever. And it looks like this might shift. Yes. You're, you're absolutely right. So this is kind of the new sensation of Knaus and the selling point. Okay. Um, Unfortunately, the shower is locked into position right now. Uh, That's okay. I'm going to have to make you imagine this. So okay. no, what happens cool. um, is that you can vertically pull at this lever and you pull the top of the shower down to about halfway and then you can sleep on the shower. So you have a full double bed at the back again. What, what, what do you mean? So exactly. That's if you take crazy. a look on the oh. lip, the entire box that is on the bed right now, it disappears oh, down. Oh, amazing. And you have a full double bed again. Amazing. I wish I could show you, but I can promise you. Do you have videos something. online? Yeah. We have so online. we will, we you will take the videos. In. Yep. Yep. We Absolutely. will definitely do that, which that's a pain in the butt for us to mm. do. But from what you're saying, 100% worth it. Three it takes three to five seconds. Wow. It's super simple. And then we have the storage up here. Very nice bed. Yeah. Nice. Oh my gosh. That is amazing. Well, Matt. Like, yeah? Oh, 
Sorry. Sorry, I got the lights on in here. Oh. I mean, it's just, it's amazing to me how little this is, but yet how they're utilizing everything. Yes. And look at the sink, it's different. Like normally you see a wet bath, it's kind of like in or it's very small. So you can, um, you can is, shift yeah, the sink say, around it looks if you like pull, it. Oh. exactly. And then it's like on a, if you pull that up, exactly. It's like on a, um, a little, <gasps> exactly. It's oh, like on rails. My so goodness. smart. So smart. Wow. That also works when the shower is down. So when the shower is down, you can fully access the bathroom and wow. use all its facilities. Wow. Oh, wow. Amazing. I see we got a cassette toilet. Yes. And even though I can't see it down, it's still it's just amazing. very exciting <laughs> because I can imagine it down. Wow. Oh my goodness, this is really cool. This might be one of the coolest ones that I've Yes. See. One of the oh, smallest. And what's great is it's definitely the smallest. Um, one of the best price and still just- Full of surprises. <laughs> really knocking out the American market yes, left and yeah, right, you know. Time. German engineering. Yeah. <laughs> love to hear it. Okay, so um, if you don't mind, can you show us another motor home? that you think would be worth everybody seeing? Yeah, absolutely. Perfect, now before he does, the reason why we're here is because Brooklyn Bedding. So let's give Brooklyn Bedding a shout out and then we'll take a look at what he has to offer. Matt's RV Reviews European Edition is proudly sponsored by Brooklyn Bedding, which is RVmattress.com. RVmattress.com made this once in a lifetime trip come true. They are 100% the reason why we were able to bring you the Matt's RV Reviews European Series. Join us after the review as we travel down Reinstraub Street. Yes, and we're gonna take you along with us. Again, if you guys need a new mattress for your RV, look no further than RVmattress.com. Here's the three best that they have to offer. The first being the Dream Foam Hybrid, which is universal comfort with cooling on contact. Next is the Signature Hybrid, which is their best seller. It is patented superior sleep at a factory direct price. Or my personal favorite, which is the Brooklyn Aurora Lux. Best in class cooling technology in a premium luxury hybrid. Best part about it, it is free shipping. You get a 120 night sleep trial guaranteed and they are 100% made in the USA. All you have to do is take it out of the box lay it out and watch it expand. Make sure you check out my video on all the different types of mattresses. I will link that video at the end of this video and in the description below. Click our link and use our promo code MAT for 20% off. Again, thank you to rvmattress.com backslash MAT. Let's continue the video. Okay, so Maximum brought us over here to what's very exciting. This unit just came out five days ago here in Dusseldorf, Germany. And with me is... Stefan. Stefan Diel. Stefan Diel, I'm PR guy from Knaus Dauber. Very nice meeting you, Ed. Thank you so much. Yeah. Tell us a little bit about this new motorhome that nobody in the world have seen yet. It's a pleasure. I mean, this is a brand new model. It's a prototype. And the clue of this car is it's a car that based on the VW Bulli. Yes. Uh, I don't know how do you, you guys call it in, in, in America, but it's in our country is VW Bulli and it's a iconic car. Yes. But what is what is the advantage of the VW Bulli? It's very compact and that's on the other hand the handicap because no regular Bulli camper has a bathroom. Okay. And if you want to have a bedroom you always have to change the couch into a bed that means you yes. always have to do something yes that's brand new with our model but from Knaus the tour CUV 4 meter 88 less than 6 meter in a total length but okay. we offer four sleeping places and we offer a living room yes a four bedroom and we offer a complete bathroom with shower with bathtub with toilet, everything, what you need. So it's a complete recreational vehicle. I love it. Yes, and you said it right for us. Thank you. Right up here, Andreas, same uh, Volkswagen chassis. chassis as the last one. Uh, something a little different going on here with the roof, which we really like. This is the first ever, right? Yes, we did that never before. It's a, it's a lifting roof. It, it, it works. Just press the button. Wow. And it lifts up. And that brings you, if it's down, the advantage is you are driving a sleek car. Yes. No airstream, nothing. It's very 
and that's important for Europe. Exactly. Yes. And you have an height in total of two meter and thirteen. That means car fits into garages as wow. well. Wow, a motorhome that fits exactly. into garages. If you arrive the camping field, the camping ground, just press the button and you have a much more headspace. That yes. means you have a lot of space to live inside. I love it. Nice. Right here we have uh, where your propane would go. And then right here, Locked. is, is this your uh -oh. garage? This is brand new. And yes. Yeah. Very and nice. You see that this is a huge garage. We have two doors, so okay. you can easy pack and repack. Yes. I love oh, your lights. It's open on this oh, side. it's open on this side. Wow, very <gasps> big and nice. Wow, I did not think it was going to be this big. Wow. But Oh my goodness. And then again, cassette toilet and more storage. And I think they're all done cleaning the inside. So. Wow. Yes. Take a look. Go on in, Andrea. Okay. And I would recommend go right because, no, to the right. Other right. Oh, yeah. other right. <laughs> because then I can show you a little bit more. First of all, as you see, we have a living space here for for four persons, a couch, two single seats. Yes. And the trick here is we have a slidable bed in the front yes. for two persons. We've seen that over there. Yeah, Amazing. Pretty cool. Pretty and cool. we have a double bed as well, a king size bed in the back. So this might be the world's smallest motorhome that could sleep five comfortably. Yes. Because this makes so. a bed as well. Exactly. And then you can have seats here. Yeah. And then when this is down, Andre, you still have plenty of headspace mm -hmm. for when you're traveling. It's like a normal vehicle. Exactly. It's like a second car. Yes. It's not, a, not that huge. That, you know, that it's a... funny because uh, when we were with Maximum over there, I thought that was one of the smallest motorhomes. But no, obviously it's this one. <laughs> yes. Right here, Andre, we have the table with the seats right there. Show that kitchen. Look at yeah. those LED lights. Kitchen is yeah, complete. very cute. You have everything Stove that you need. The sink. We have a huge fridge here. Oh yeah. Around uh -oh. the corner. Ice as well. Yes. Wow. So everything's here. Got some drawers here. It's a wow. RV. And the Soft trick box. is the bathroom. Let me yes. show you the bathroom. What's going on there? I don't know. It's oh. very crazy. May I? Yes. yes. Sorry. Matt, you could have just gave me the camera. So this is a regular position. So, and we have another cover here for the top. Okay. Which is here over to show you that a little bit faster. That's the yes, reason why. Yes, yes. So it's very easy right now. If you see, that's the position. Oh yeah. Oh, so it's I, down. I'm cleaning my teeth. Yes. I'm washing my hands right okay. now. Okay. If I want to use the toilet, I'm sliding the tab a little bit to the left. Okay and I can use the toilet as well. Now you're waking up, you want to have a shower and I want to read a little bit in the bed. So what we can do is right now here, very easy, just get that out. <gasps> this is what, what Maximum was telling us about. And now. Oh my good, oh my that. goodness. Wow. This is just crazy. Like the other one. Oh and now you have a shower. Gosh. And your partner is able to take a nap, and you having the Unbelievable. show, Phenomenal. and everything's here. Unbelievable! And I cannot believe that. And that's in a car which is less than six meters wow. in total. Amazing! This Not is... only that, look at all the skylights in here. Yes, that is look amazing. That. And thank you so much for showing us that feature. This is incredible. Wow. It really is. Oh my goodness. And then let's climb out. Wow. I didn't think I the could The pop be top's revolutionary. Any more blown away. <laughs> and then the fact that it just fits in the garage comfortably, right. it's amazing. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for showing us. Pleasure. Come, and, come over whenever you want. Yes, and we'll make sure to link their website down below. And if you guys are loving these European editions, make sure you guys tune in next week to Max RV Reviews Europe Edition, where we're going to bring you more awesome. Oh, is there something on my neck? Make sure you guys tune in next week to Matt's RV Reviews European Edition, where we're going to bring you more RVs from Europe over here. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye-bye. Welcome to Rheinstraff Street. Hey, all right. So I only thought we would have one kind of video tour in Germany. And then 
Will wants to go to the Lint chocolate store. Kati uh -huh. me. Kati does. I want to too because we saw we went there last night and it was closed and so we just like looked in and all sad. So and then I'm like, whoa! I'm like, it's happening down here. And um, from what I understand, this is where like the Oktoberfest celebrations really, really are partying. Yeah, there's a lot of restaurants. We were in this area last night. And there's tons of restaurants and and pubs and stuff like traditional German pubs. Well, let's go. What if you're like my dad and just say, Sehr gut. Sehr gut. Prost. 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 I bet you you can get a Das Boot here. I hope we don't get a Das Boot and get so drunk that we need to go in a Kranker wagon to the Kranker <laughs> That is funny. That's what I just said. I hope we don't need to go to Kranker. <laughs> I mean, you can tell this was probably the downtown city back in the day. Yeah. Like, look at how old the buildings are. Well, this isn't the actual street we were on last night. We should try to get over there too because there's like, it's really pretty because, I don't think this is the street happening. It's a different street. Wow. I love seeing the row homes like that. I know. Oh, and then look at that. Dude, it looks like Diagon Alley, doesn't it? Yeah. This might be the street. Oh. What is this for the street? Wait, it's just up there. Yes, this is a burger. Yes. Oh, like burger cookies from Baltimore. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is where we ate last night. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's some German looking stuff. Yeah, you walk in, you, there no, there's no host. Like I, we walked in and, and like we just like walked all the way almost we were almost back into the kitchen and I was like I don't know what to do and then I saw a guy and I was like where do we just sit and he's like yeah I'll sit anywhere. <laughs> Gross. Also they don't have um, still water. Yeah, Kati asked for still water because they gave us sparkling and we don't like sparkling. Yeah. So the guy said you can go get it, tap water from the bath. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> he don't. Oh, excuse me. He doesn't have time for your American games. Well, apparently it's the secret to getting. Tap water. The tap water here is actually like very, very regulated. They said the tap water here is healthier than bottled water. Really? Yeah. Interesting. Andrea would love this. She loves that type of food there. Does she? Yeah. Are they coming for dinner with us? Uh, I think so. Do, 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 do. Hey, don't worry. Be yeah. happy now. Um, yeah, if you guys want to come to the Matt Servieri's rally, it's January 12th through the 15th. Nobody really watched or cared about our announcement video, Will. There's but gelato, Will. there you go. Lint, look at her. Is it closed? Oh, I would love to see the disappointment recorded. <laughs> no, there's people in there. Yeah. Why would they close at six when all this, like when people are drunk, that's when they want to buy. Yeah, they close at eight. eight. Oh, okay. No, but it does get, it, the, I think it quiets down early. Dude. Oh, really? Yeah. you think it's only six? This is kind of popping at six. These are the best. I don't even like chocolate that much. No, give me like a freaking smoked rib. <laughs> so I like these because when I was little, my mom would put one of these in my lunch that she packed and she would write me a cute little note. Uh -huh. She loved me. And the kids at the table made fun of me. <laughs> <laughs> you were probably the kids Norman, at the table. Norman Dyson, if you're watching. Hey, Norman. <laughs> that who was? Hey, Norman. Hey, Norman. Remember that time you made fun of me and then I beat you arm wrestling? <laughs> I made it. I, I made it. You I'm see me lunch. now, Norman? Can you see me? I'm in Lent in Germany. <laughs> Oh, so oh, you gotta hold the bag on the outside and represent. Yes. Lint. VIP customers, Americans. <laughs> oh, worth all the money I spent. Every last dime. Try it. Just try it. You'll never Actually, get it. Hey, hey! Oh! 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 Oh!
job. So, okay, okay, ladies and gentlemen, thank hey. you.